Welcome back for another video. Before we begin this video though, I just want to let y'all know Barrio Tales hoodies are now available. Red, black, purple, orange, and blue. Cash App and PayPal are how you can reach me. They're only $25 with free shipping. Don't just look at it, wear it. T-shirts are also available still. All you gotta do is hit that Cash App and PayPal that you see right there. Thank you. Welcome back for another video on the best YouTube channel ever. Today's video will be about a man named Paulo Virgin Mendoza, born on December 28, 1986. Paulo also went by the fake name of Gustavo Perez Arriaga and what he did that got himself recognized on a national level. Paulo Virgin Mendoza, aka Gustavo Arriaga, was a Mexican national or better known as a paisa. Ariaga, who worked as a farm laborer, Paulo also was a Serrano's gang member who proudly displayed his Serrano affiliation. As you can see, Paulo moved from Mexico to California. The specific setting of the story is Newman, California, in the Newman Police Department in Stainslaw County, California, located in the San Joaquin Valley region of the Greater Central Valley. The other subject besides Paulo is a new men police officer named Ranil Singh. While working overtime on Christmas Day in 2018, Ranil Singh had first encountered Paulo when he conducted a traffic stop on Paulo because Paulo appeared to be driving under the influence of alcohol or drugs. Paulo had a criminal record and history of DUI drunk driving charges in the past. Officer Singh pulled over Paulo at Merced Street and Eucalyptus Avenue in Newman just before 1 a.m. As Officer Singh approached Paulo, that's when Paulo opened fire on Officer Singh, effectively killing him. On the night, Newman Police Corporal Ronel Singh was fatally shot. The officers and deputies responding to help him thought he'd been kidnapped. Law enforcement had already taped off the area of the shooting with crime scene tape and search teams were being assembled when a Merced County Sheriff's deputy arriving at the scene at least 12 minutes after the shooting spotted Singh's body. The search for Paulo Mendoza ended up being a 55-hour manhunt before Paulo was finally captured. Police surrounded a home in Bakersfield, California, 200 miles south of where the crime took place. Throughout the investigation into finding Mendoza, there were a lot of inconsistencies and in statements about Mendoza's whereabouts that didn't make sense. Because of that, a total of seven people had been arrested for either misleading authorities about Ariaga's whereabouts or aiding him in evading authorities, including a woman described as Ariaga's girlfriend and two of his brothers. Ariaga's brother, Adrian Virgin, and co-worker Eric Rosso Quirez were arrested and accused of acting as accomplices. Another brother, Conrado Virgin Mendoza, and Ariaga's girlfriend, Anna Lyde Cervantes, were arrested for aiding Ariaga in evading authorities. Three additional people were also arrested in the South Valley for aiding and abetting Ariaga, Bernabe Madrigal Castaneda, Erasmo Villegas, and Maria Luisa Moreno. The trio was inside the house where Ariaga was arrested. The crime itself sparked debate about sanctuary states and immigration. On November 5, 2020, Paulo Virgin Mendoza, a.k.a. Gustavo Oriaga, admitted in court to intentionally shooting and killing Singh. During a traffic stop on December 28, 2018, he had also admitted to three special circumstances including committing murder in an attempt to evade arrest, killing a police officer in the performance of his duties, and discharging a firearm from a motor vehicle with the intent to inflict death. Eight others were also charged with helping Mendoza run away before he was caught. At least five of those people have been convicted in federal court. As for Paulo Virgin Mendoza, a.k.a. Gustavo Oriago, Paulo's punishment was Paulo received life in prison without the possibility of parole.